So one thing that I've noticed, I mean, I noticed it a long time ago, is that having an RV takes a lot of teamwork. Yes. With a house, an apartment, like that takes a lot of teamwork too, but I feel like this is more, I mean, it's close quarters teamwork, so I think you kind of notice it more. Like you have to figure out how to maneuver around each other. Like we're both always doing dishes because the sink is tiny. You get your little routines. One person does one thing and you kind of work in unison. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, but also it's uh, it's kind of nice. So it is consistent work with an RV. I mean, I don't even know who mentioned this or who said it originally, but basically if you wake up in the morning and make your bed, that's your first task completed. And so if you keep doing little tasks like that, like I, get, I just call them micro tasks, just because they're kind of insignificant, like of the overall like grand scheme of your day. Like, but I mean, really what they do is they get you in that mindset of keep moving forward, keep adding on those tasks and completing them and then uh, take on the next big one and bigger and bigger and so on. So you love that. I love that. He love loves it. I can I make see checklists. in his head, like it's the little matrix screen, like all the numbers going by and that's him making his little task. There's yeah. all these tiny little things that he's always doing and I can tell like right now he's kind of in, in a mode and he just wants to get stuff done so we can make dinner and eat. Right? That's the ultimate goal. Like <laughs> I do all this just so I can do nothing. <laughs> Really it is because you can't you can't really be comfortable in a trailer if it's a complete disaster. So Here, if it's not like Instagram ready, you can't actually relax. <laughs> we can't actually relax. Don't <laughs> pan the camera around. Don't pan yeah. it. <laughs> if you get up in the morning and you didn't do dishes the night before, it's a mess and you can't make breakfast because there aren't dishes and there's no counter space to actually make your breakfast. So it's like you have to do stuff as you go. She's Louise, so my phone, I guess the storage is full and then it freaked out and stopped filming. What we were saying, he's now on to his next task. You do all of these little things so that you can live more comfortably. Otherwise you will just be living in stuff and dirty dishes, essentially. So we live around this area, right there. And we're gonna take the RV, well, we don't know how we're getting there exactly. I'm just gonna draw a straight line. We're gonna go straight up to Colorado Springs. Yeah. That's where your parents are going? Uh, no. So that's where we're gonna go, that's where I'm gonna work. And then whenever my parents get there, we're gonna probably go, I think we're gonna go all the way up here, somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think we're going all the way up. It's a long way back. That is a long way back. And most of it's Texas. Yeah, most of it is Texas. It's like that far is like or actually Jeez, this. That's crazy. Yeah, that's outside of Texas. And I think we do go right through this area normally, which I thought about going over here. Where is it? Yeah, like right here. That's where your aunt lives. Oh, yeah. And then we'd have to cut back and then go up. But just look at that. Man. All right, guys, so I just wanted to finish out this video. How you doing? I'm working. <laughs> busy right now. You're not going to get anything done with me here. I know. I know that already. <laughs> so... I wasn't even typing. Our channel... Hey, our channel... Our channel... What? We're almost about, at 15,000 subscribers. That's cool. <laughs> that is cool. I, no, I'm that really excited really about cool. it. But this... <laughs> while I'm doing this. Well, pause it for a second. Just put the pause on. You pause um, it. Are you done? What, no? Oh my God. So, <laughs> we're almost at 15,000 subscribers and I just wanted to let you guys know that when we hit 15,000, we're gonna do a giveaway and it's gonna be awesome. I have ordered two items so far to include, uh, but I also wanna put in just some various like treats and things that we really enjoy, AKA like, cookies and I don't I don't know what he eats. I'm not gonna send you guys hot dogs in the mail. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I'm not getting anything. Anyway. 
I'm not gonna see you guys. <laughs> I just thought that was funny. Um, so we're gonna include some fun little goodies that. Uh, I think we've gotten hot dogs in the mail, haven't we? We got tofurkey burger meat in the mail. But they sent it like freeze in the cooler with like freeze dried little packages. We, we're not gonna do that. Anyway, no so, I've, so I've ordered um, two items to include and it's gonna have a bunch more stuff uh, and I'm really excited. So you guys, if you are watching this video and you're interested in our content, make sure to subscribe because we, we will upload a video with all of the items that will be included and then we're gonna figure out how to choose one person to get that said goodie care package basket type of thing. And I'm really excited about it. So I hope you guys are too. Yeah, if there's anything that you guys want to see as far as uh, branded items, let us know in the comments if you're excited about the giveaway, cause I am. Uh, we haven't done, I think I did a giveaway for the YouTube channel back when it was a fitness channel at like a thousand subscribers. Uh, and it went really well. The person that won really enjoyed the care package. I, I call them care packages, but anyway, so stay tuned Bye. for that. Okay guys, I just wanted to give you a heads up about it and that's gonna be it for today's video. Hope you'll have a good day and we will see y'all on Friday. Yeah, Friday. Have fun out there. <laughs> Bye.